I'm Matt Mitchell with Northwest Indian Mixtape. I'm here with Colonel Buster and Three Piece Dinner. Just uh, tell us a little about yourselves. Oh, uh, well, we're a uh, band that plays uh, rockabilly music and vintage country music, a lot of stuff from the 50s, um, even back as far as the 20s, actually. And uh, this is kind of the, uh, the rockabilly sector. We have another, another kind of more old-timey bluegrass unit that we play with where we do more of the banjo-y, mandolin type stuff, too. Cool. So, um, you guys put a pretty killer show on today. Oh, thanks. What's your uh, favorite part of that? What drives you? Uh, I guess what what drives me is uh, is my strong rhythm section here. They kind of drive me and motivate <laughs> me, and uh, you know, make me feel good about playing. Yeah. <laughs> How about you guys? Um, I guess what drives me to play music it's kind of just in a cheesy way. It's it's an emotional release, you know, stress release to get up there and kind of. Um, get away from life for a second. I don't yeah. know. Just, just kind <laughs> of do, do your thing, you know, and have fun with uh, good friends. So Joe brings up a good point. Yeah, it's a you know, 30 minutes, <laughs> a two-hour stress reliever. Yeah, it's good <laughs> to watch everybody dance. It's good to get out. It's good to play music. And it's good to watch people coming out and support. And we need more people doing it. Yeah. So, uh, what are your personal influences? Uh. My personal influences are like uh, some of the old school guitar pickers like Scotty Moore from Elvis's uh, original group. Uh, I like Chet Atkins, uh, Carl Perkins, stuff like that. Um, I've always had like an eclectic taste in music and I've never really focused on just a few influences. I guess my um, my style is a blend of a lot of different influences, but mostly just from the people I play with, like learning vicariously through playing with Buster and you know all the little little things <laughs> he's uh, picked up over the years from his influences. Um, that's what influences me. How about you? And me. Like I said, uh, I do like rockabilly, but I'm more of a 60s, 70s R&B guy. Soul. You know, I do love Little Richard, but Little Richard to me is R&B. So you guys can take that how it is. And <laughs> Ernest Hub, love Ernest Hub, Hank Sr., and, you know, country music's been downhill since Hank Jr. <laughs> True. <laughs> All right, so uh, you guys, uh, you said you were writing? Uh, we're, we're writing a little bit, and uh, we're fixing to record in a little while, but we have no, like, no set plans. No immediate sort of thing, plans. But, uh, okay. Just going to uh, kind of work it out and see what happens. We have a uh, distance issue. Buster lives in Northwest Indiana. I live in Chicago. <laughs> Nate lives in Woodstock. Which is almost oh, okay. <laughs> so um, he's got kids. I'm getting married. And Nate's finding himself. Yeah. Congratulations, <laughs> by the way. I'll find myself with the local shake dancers. <laughs> so, yeah, it's, Congratulations. Thank you. It's, uh, I guess we kind of write and practice in our spare time. It's, Which is never. <laughs> All right, so uh, you guys got anything else you'd like to add? Uh, just watch for Colonel Buster's three-piece dinner, uh, you know. We'll be playing more. We don't know when, we don't know where, but just keep your eye out. <laughs> we will. No, that's good. Thank you. Come out and dance. We'll put a smile on your face and, you know, a little <laughs> wiggle in your booty. <laughs> finger licking, finger licking good, y'all. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm Adam Mitchell for Northwest Indian Mixtape. This is Colonel Buster and three-piece dinner. See you guys.